didn't want to come back. Why would I, after all that's happened, even in here? So, where is the journal? California crisp white wines. Mm. I'll need a crate of those when I get out of here. Is that me? Oh my god, the hair. What was I thinking? Look, Mr. Torres. I'm happy he finally got remarried. A honeymoon in the Bahamas. Wish I was there with them. More than a hundred again today? Glad I don't have to deal with that anymore. No, that's her parents' room. Don't need to go in there. That's the bathroom. Kelsey. Yes, I'm talking to you. I know you've been reading my journal. Can I ever forgive you for what you did? Honestly, I don't know. I'm trying really hard, but I don't know how. Because I don't understand any of it. You are my friend, and I loved you unconditionally. I did what I did because of you, and I stood up to him because of you. But you... I don't know. Right now, I can't be near you, so I don't want you to come find me. I promise I'll be all right. Marie. Except she wouldn't be. She would not be all right. people they chose to pair me with the girl from food rescue outrageous but i got over it and chose to work my ass off 
I had to if I wanted to get that scholarship. Hated that thing. Trevor was never far off, though. When Marie and I rode our bikes through dark nights just to get it, she wouldn't stop about time travel and black holes and stuff. I just wanted to do something simple. Calculate shit. Boring. Trevor. What an asshole. After we broke up, he got violent sometimes. One day, he dragged me through the school hall by my shirt until one of Marie's geek friends stopped him. Disgusting, but cheap. I got used to them after I didn't want to go to the food kitchen anymore. I wore those a lot. Not to protect... Sometimes they got so hot, this thing wasn't doing it anymore. Then we'd take off to Mr. Jones's swimming pool. That night... I guess he must have seen us. Marie always dreamed about going to Europe. I don't think she ever went. Damn, what's the password again? I need to find it. in their own house not long after we met at food rescue he was stabbed almost died she was knocked out with a baseball bat she was in the hospital for a while stitches Mr. Marie insisted on saving these she was going to make a new world with them whatever that was supposed to be she hated my cigarettes. Every time I felt like going out and buying a pack, she made me put the money in that money jar. I'm not a shadow person. Why does someone need to get hurt before we step up and act, for Christ's sake? Oh no. Why didn't you tell me, Marie? No wonder you were so frightened. We never should have gone to the Orange Grove. One day, I... When... Bumblebee... Marie... What were you thinking? You know that's illegal. Lorraine, Marie's mom? died when she was five. My mother, she might as well have been dead. She looked more dead than alive, anyhow. Passed out on the couch, empty bottles of gin on the floor.
She once asked me, don't you ever dream, Kelsey? And I said, I don't. I don't dream. I plan. What I didn't tell her was that I wouldn't allow anyone to mess with those plans. That's Trevor's phone number. He called her. I knew he blamed her for everything, though she should have blamed him for what he did to her and Mr. Torres. Mr. Torres loved that beer. After the robbery, he only had a couple left. Apparently, they were hard to come by. Still, we decided to try a bottle once. to find the key. A five-figure number. God damn it. What is the combination, Marie? Maybe she kept it in here somewhere. She must have written... She loved being a birthday girl. Mr. Torres would take her shopping every year. I loved skinny dipping, but Marie insisted on wearing this thing. Really, I mean, it was... I couldn't afford a car, and Marie didn't want one, so we... Food rescue. Yeah, it was a good place to be, until Marie showed up. Mr. Torres gave me my own set of keys, so I'd feel at home. I loved him for it, but every time I used those keys, I felt a pang of guilt. Every Tuesday, the food trucks would roll in. Me and Marie never missed Jorge's tamales. When I was a She asked me why I was so angry all the time. That's Marie's birthday. That's weird. I guess she wrote it down for that Ben guy, for her pizza and movie party. All right, I might have. That's Marie's birthday.
need to find the key. A five-figure number. Yay! Good work, Kelsey. Oh my god. The past, like the future, is indefinite and exists only as a spectrum of possibilities. Stephen Hawkins said that. I wish it were true. But there was nothing I could do about the past. It was definite as hell. Sometimes I didn't get Marie. I really thought a night by Jones's pool would help her relax. She used to love it there. But she insisted someone had been watching us. I just wanted to have a good time, and she was ruining it, so I said some things I shouldn't have. She just stood there, staring at the window. I was so annoyed. And that's when I knew she'd been right. Trevor. Right there in the room. He'd just come in through the open window. How did he find us? He didn't know where Marie and I lived. I always made sure of that. But he took an orange from his backpack and started peeling it. It had been Trevor by the pool. And he'd followed us home. He said to Marie, I told you not to mess with me. But still, I didn't get it. No, it wasn't until he started moving in on her that I realized it was Marie. He was after Marie. He blamed her for everything, and he had a knife. I'd never seen him so angry, so evil. Marie tried to get it away from him. He asked her why she never answered her phone. Did she not read her emails? Or did she think they were hollow threats? God, I just wanted to punch him with anything I could lay my hands on. My backpack. I smashed it against his wrist, knocking the knife out of his hands. Marie went for it, but Trevor was faster. He kicked her in the head. I dove for the knife, but he jumped me. As we struggled, he hissed. Didn't I get enough action yet? Maybe I needed another baseball bat to get my kicks. I stopped, because right then I knew what he was up to. He asked Marie about Mr. Torres. Was he all right? Did he still get stomach aches? Marie lay on the floor by the bed, in shock, realizing it had been Trevor who almost killed her father. Then Trevor looked at me, added with a smile. And her. That's when it all went to pieces. Trevor ripped us apart, and he was enjoying it. Marie didn't understand. I tried to explain, apologized, but she wasn't listening. She kept asking me if I'd been there with Trevor in their house. Trevor stirred things up even more. He told her it was me who had hit her over the head with a baseball bat, that I'd enjoyed it. I screamed in frustration, no, that's not what happened. Tears streamed down Marie's face. She couldn't believe I would do that, hurt her deliberately. God, I wanted Trevor to stop talking. I attacked him, scratched his face, hit him wherever I could. I hated him. He was twisting everything. I wanted to tell her that I was sorry. Yes, we robbed the house, and we got caught by Mr. Torres, but I never meant for anyone to get hurt. I didn't smash Marie's head. I panicked. I wanted to stop her from seeing me. When I realized how badly injured she was, I called the police. I tried to stay, but Trevor wouldn't let me. He pulled me by my hair into the van. But Marie wasn't listening. I was losing it, and I like to think I beat Trevor up pretty good. But Trevor punched back harder and faster. He was about to crack my skull. Marie clawed for the box beside her, opened it. She screamed, told us to stop, pointed that nine millimeter at us. Trevor went nuts, charged for her, she screamed, told him to stay back. She'd never shot a gun in her life. She wasn't going to start now. Trevor grabbed her by the shoulders and... What do you think you remember is not necessarily what really happened, or how others remember it. But Trevor fell back on the carpet, dead. That we all remember. Mom, where are you? Did
Did you get the journal? I'll be down in a minute. Anna Marie is getting a little worked up here. She threatened to smoke a cigar in your car. Don't let her. Don't let her smoke. I love that car. She knows you do. Get down here, Mom. You're taking, like, forever. I'll be down in a minute.